The 32nd participant in the Silva Challenge is Morten Henningsen. This one's going to Norway. <laughs> That's kind of exciting, huh? Uh, so it's another international shipment. And let's see what we can put together for him. I like though. This is a Partridge family look, obviously an art card, letter H. Uh, let's see, this is a Hot Wheels cool one. This thing I could see being gas landed out into something pretty cool. And there's that part of me that's all, when I when I look at something, it's like I get ideas too as I'm putting these together. And it's like, maybe I should keep this. <laughs> this one. No, this one's going off. Um, oh, Got to put some aircraft in here. This one, an Apache. Yeah, an Apache. What's that say? AH-64? Yeah, it's under the yellow stripe. That's a Hot Wheels. So uh, I'm just going to set that in there, kind of in the middle for now. And uh, I'll move it around. Here's an old Redline tow truck. Yeah. That's pretty cool. What else do we have? If there's going to be a tow truck, should I throw a fire truck in there? That's a Hot Wheels fire truck. Yeah, what the heck? Why not? I'm trying to also learn. Remember last time I forgot that I should put these on the side sometimes that they'll sit better. I can squeeze more in there that way. Here's an old Matchbox. Why am I saying old about everything? A Matchbox Caterpillar tractor. Yeah, that's kind of cool. Oh, apparently that's fixed. Huh. Oh well, that'll fit without any problem. Oh, what else do I want to throw in here? Oh, here's <laughs> here's something obviously without wheels. What the heck? It's a Hot Wheels something or other. Is that an old Jeep or? I really don't know enough about it to say, but that'll fit in there without any problems. Here's an old Matchbox field car. Super fast. Seems like there was a roof that went over this as well. That snapped on. But get that in there. So many possibilities. Here's a Hot Wheels 87 Dodge D100. Even if someone was to keep this, those wheels really need to be swapped out on that thing. That, yeah, to say it's not attractive is an understatement. <laughs> a boat? Uh, how about a hydrofoil? Isn't that what this is? Let's see, uh, hovercraft. Matchbox super fast hovercraft. Yeah, that could be interesting. That, something like that, I'm always curious what you might make with it. There's a hydroplane, but I'm gonna set that aside for now since I've already got some biohazard removal. Uh, and that's a hot, okay, the biohazard removal gets it thrown in, why not? Just like, why not a tractor? <laughs> Matchbox, tractor. The, do those wheels look, I don't know, those wheels look way too snazzy for a tractor. Plastic fenders on this thing, huh. What else should I throw in there? Get an old Woody. Oh, this is one of the old Hot Wheels with the uh, base that you can raise up to the back end. Just kind of click adjusts however high you want it. That gives it kind of a cool rake on it. Yeah, let's leave. Or leave. Let's throw that in here. Now to figure out the helicopter around this stuff. Yeah, that'll work. Oh, I like this one. What's the phone called again? The Rip Rod. Hot Wheels Rip Rod. That definitely needs more off-road looking wheels. 
It has an off-road look to it, and then wheels that definitely aren't off-road wheels. I'm not sure. It, it's a common theme on these. I'm never quite sure what they're thinking. Another fire truck. This one's the backdrafter. Gotta love the engine on that. Couldn't you see that with like a big gun up here? <laughs> no? That's just me? <laughs> I sometimes wonder, is it me? <laughs> Am I the weird one? That's like a given. Hmm. Diesel boy. I like the engine on that. That that could be really interesting too. That has, excuse me, that has a lot of potential. Ooh, that's bad. Oh. Oh, here you go. That's cool. I should know the name of this one. I don't. I forget what used to be on the back of this. That's a Hot Wheels black wall, that plastic base, metal body. But that has a cool look to it. That That isn't necessarily like a gas lens kind of look, but you definitely could do something with that. And it looks like we have room for one. pieces of all kinds of things floating around too. The, you know, I think I'm going to throw the diaper dragger in there. And for no reason other than the engine on the diaper dragger is nice and a lot of people steal the engines off of those specifically. And here's the Hot Wheels Solar Reflex that is flat. So that looks like that'll fit in there well. I think there's, yeah, there's a Blackwell Hot Wheels Camaro, I believe. I think it's an old Camaro. 1982 Mattel doesn't really say, but uh, yeah, that will round it out pretty nicely. I think that's it for the cars. And now, let's throw some other junk in here. <laughs> This is where a lot of the boxes, whoa, stuff is falling all over the place here. This is where the boxes will have a lot of similarity because of what I print and throw in the boxes. Here's some engines, some skulls, guns, bigger guns, smaller guns more bigger guns. The rockets. Some of these pieces, in fact, as I'm recording this, I've recently released a video of a build I did where um, I'm using, actually, no, that build is still in process. Excuse me. But I love these wheels so much that I end up using these wheels on that build. I'm really happy with the design of these wheels. And uh, all I can say is I need to print more. Rams. More Rams. Some exhausts. I think, oh, I don't think I included any tanks in there, which, yeah, there are uh, <laughs> tanks on that build of mine that I was talking about as well. So I think, no, I was about to say, I think that's it. I'm not throwing some other wheels in here too. Let's throw one of mine for four of these. I mean, it's going all the way to Norway. <laughs> now, that's it. Move this out of the way. So, Morton, this is heading your way. Have fun with this. Have a blast. Uh, everybody, I hope you enjoy this video. 
and uh, can't wait to see what Morton puts together out of this. Everyone stay safe and healthy out there. Catch you in the next one.